Hey and welcome to um, session 11 of our Let's Keep Moving series. Hopefully you've done your warm up now and you're ready to go. If not, go back and do that. Um, introducing today a slight change in that we're going to add in some tins if you want to, you don't have to, just to make our arms work a little bit harder as we try and keep our heart rate up, try and keep our blood and body temperature up a little bit and try and keep our um, breathing a little bit quicker. So you've done your first 10 sessions, so this is kind of a bit of a progression on those similar exercises, so you'll recognise probably most of them I'd say by now, um, and you will be doing different levels again, so level 1, level 2, level 3 for most of the exercises. Pick your level and let's get going. So 15 minutes, same process, so a minute of each exercise and then the second time round 30 seconds of each exercise. You can add your weight in, it doesn't have to be as heavy as a tin, it can be heavier if you prefer, or up to you. Feel free to not use a weight at all if you want to. Okay, let's go. So we're starting with our marching. Ready, let's go. We've got a minute here. So getting those legs nice and high. Go into a jog if you want to. So your level two is here. Notice my arms are still working. Level three, you're in your jog, but your knees are coming high. So pick your level and stay there. If you're in your level one, Try and speed those legs and those arms up a little bit if you can. So you're going as fast as you're comfortable to go. Big strong march with those arms the whole time. If you want to try and go up to the next level, feel free to try for a few marches. So coming up to level two, then feel free to drop back down to your march. 10 seconds left here. Three seconds and we're going to move into our putting our box on our shelf. Here we go. Reaching for your box, up onto the shelf. Then to the right. Up to the left. Up to the right. Try and reach, push through your toes if you can. As fast or as slow as you're comfortable. Come down as far as comfortable. So this is your squat going down. You might want to do quarter half or full squat and then you'll reach up from there. As you squat down to your parcel, reach in through your heels as you push up, reach in through your toes. Good, last 10 seconds. One more reach and into our star jumps here. So level one, you're doing your steps. Level two, small pause. Level three, without a pause. Pick your level. If you're level one, try and speed those legs up a little bit. If you're level two, try and reduce that pause down a little bit. And if you're level two and you want to try, then try not to do your level three. Again, feel free to try a couple and then come back down. Feel free to add a couple of these in each side. Fifteen seconds left here. Whichever level star jump you're doing, you can make sure those arms are coming nice and high. And into lunges here. So you're lunging, swapping legs. So alternate leg lunges, add your arms in if you can. The back leg doing the work, you're reaching that back knee down towards the floor as far as you comfortably can. You want to try and keep your knee aligned with your hip and your foot on that leg as it reaches towards the floor and that front knee nice and stable. So as fast or as slow as you're comfortable and that you can keep your stability. Just going as deep as you're comfortable. You don't have to reach the floor with your knee every time. So even a small quarter lunge, whatever you're happy doing. The last 
couple of seconds here, and then we're going to move into our V steps. V steps here. So V at the front, so wide at the front, narrow at the back, and you're either going to step or jump back. And think about adding your arms in as you come forward, arms come up, as you come backwards, arms come down. So if you're jumping, or if you're stepping. Try and speed those steps up if you can. Last 15 seconds here. Try and speed up as much as you can for these last few seconds. And we're going to move into our squats from here. So feet about hip width apart, reaching down with your bum. Squeeze your bum down through your heels. So as deep as you're comfortable. So you've got the options quarter squat level one, half squat level two, full squat level three. So let's bring that to the side. So quarter squat, half squat, full squat. Pick your level, try and bring your arms up to shoulder height if you can as well. Feel free to take them higher if you prefer. Stay with your level that you reach down to and also the, the rate that you're comfortable working at. Three more seconds here and we're going to move into our butt kicks here. Here we go, level one. Arms come out as your heel comes up. If you want to speed that up a little bit. Come into a bit more of a hop. Good then. So level one here. Level two. Level three. Bringing that back down, level one. Speeding that up a little bit if you can, if you're staying with your step in. 10 seconds left here. Let's get that pace up a little bit more. Three seconds, and we're gonna move into our single leg dips here. So right leg. Single leg dip, and just adding your arms in if you can. If you feel like you need balance for this one, feel free to just use that one arm and use the other arm on a wall or a chair, whatever you need there to, to keep your balance. Last five seconds, and change your legs over. Same on this side, single leg dip. Again, you need balance. 10 seconds left here. And into our can can here. Bent knee, straight knee, bent knee, straight knee. So step it. Level one here. Into a hop for level two. Into a bit faster hop for level three. Keep going. 30 seconds left. And then we've got our walk out for 10 minutes. your level, bring it down a bit if you need to, bring it into your walk if you need to, concentrate on getting that height in your leg if you can, last 
last couple of seconds and into your walk. Just pop your tins away for a minute if you're using them and take a minute here. Get your breath back. Okay, 30 seconds left. Just try and keep your leg moving gently. We've got five more minutes. And we're going to do each of those exercises again for 30 seconds each. Try and use your weight again if you can. Okay, so we're going again in 10 seconds. So you're picking your weights up. And we're going to move into our marching or jogging. In three, two, one, here we go. So up into your march, get those arms moving, come into your level two, your jog, or your level three, your high knee jog here. Keep that going. If you want to try the next level, have a go. Feel free to try it and go back down, that's fine. Ten seconds left here. Okay, three seconds, then we're going to put our box onto our shelf to the left and right, here goes, reaching up to that shelf, through your heels on the way down, pushing up through your toes on the way up, keep your pace wherever you're comfortable, five seconds left here, then we're moving into our star, Marches or our star jumps from here. So star jumps, level one, level two, or level three. So pick your level. If you're on level one again, try and speed up a little bit. If you're on level two, see if you can make that pause a little bit um, shorter. Level three, stay where you are. Last couple here, then we're going to go into our lunges forward. Alternate legs. Again, just as low and the pace that you're comfortable at. One more each leg. And we're going to move into our V-steps from here. So either stepping forward and stepping back, or stepping forward and jumping back. Last one here, and into our squats. So again, feet about hip width apart, squeezing your bum down towards the floor, weight going through your heels, as deep as you're comfortable. Think level one, quarter squat, level two, half squat, level three, full squat. Five seconds left, keep that going. And one more, and then into our butt kicks here. If you're doing your steps, speeding those up, or you can go into your hops. So you can go into your faster hops. Pick your level again. If you're down as your steps, do remember to just keep that pace as high as you can. Make sure it's comfortable last couple and into right single leg dips here again if you need something to hold on to to keep your balance take one hand away try and keep your other arm lifting and lowering with you 
last couple on this leg and change the left. seconds left here then we're going to move into our can can to finish off 30 seconds and into our can can here if you can come up into this hop speed it up if you can if you want to stay with the walking so you've got a static leg on the floor then do Try and bring that left up as high as you can. 10 seconds left to go. Bent knee, straight knee, bent knee, straight knee. Last couple. One more on each leg and walk out. Well done. weights down, let your arms have a bit of a swing out as well. And just stay a few more seconds and just re roll those shoulders backwards a bit. So big circles with your shoulders. work through your cool down here as well and relax there lovely so that takes you through session 11 so you're now way over and you're up to your 165th minute completed with moderate intensity exercises so well done keep it going and I've already planned session 12 so I'll see you again for that one very soon enjoy your day and stay safe